Greetings all, it's the Devious Monkey here. It is Friday morning and it's gonna be another day of sitting inside doing day job work, which I already told you about. Say la vie, right? Anyways, I'm on my way to pick up my mouse. I bought a new mouse to use for editing and all that kind of stuff on the new MacBook Pro. I just always prefer a mouse. It's just a hell of a lot easier for me to do stuff. I get very frustrated trying to use trackpads. They're convenient if you're just sitting there surfing and goofing around and shit, but when you're doing stuff like editing and moving files and all that kind of shit, gotta have a mouse. I have to have a mouse, put it that way. So uh, I bought it last night online and I'm just gonna go pick it up. So let's go get a mouse. All right, so they put stickers all over it and shit because I bought it online, but I picked up my new, uh, what is this? MX Master 3S wireless Bluetooth super duper mouse with super sensitivity and all that shit. The most important thing is it does vertical scrolling standard with the little wheel, but it also does horizontal scrolling in addition to having two programmable buttons. So that horizontal scroll is why I got it because uh, I can use it on timelines when I'm, when I'm editing. That way I don't have to use my trackpad at all because I hate using the trackpads, like I said. Uh, the other thing that I got, I was thinking about getting it, but I didn't purchase it. But when I went there and I looked, I ended up getting the MX uh, Keys, what is this? MX Keys Advanced Wireless Keyboard to go with it. And the reason I bought this is because it was an open box and it was uh, considerably less expensive than buying one brand new. And I'm, it says it's in excellent condition. I'll just figure that it is. Hopefully it ain't goofed up, but got that too. That will finish out getting everything that I need to get for the, the MacBook Pro to edit and stuff at home much easier and more efficiently. The desk sized mouse pad thingy is out for delivery. So I'll get that at some point. That'll give me another nice breaking point to, to leave, the, uh, leave my place when I need a break from sitting there because yesterday I sat there all damn day except for going to get lunch and it was too much. Mwah. So that's it. Now we're gonna go home and do day job work. Yay. Okay, kids, I got a couple of deliveries, but I'm still waiting on that big ass mouse pad to cover the desk. They just keep pushing it back and back. So I did everything else. I'm just about done with the special project for day job. Uh, I'm waiting on a couple of stragglers that I don't know what their problem is. So I'm done with that shit. What I got today, like I said, was this MX Master 3S for this reason and this reason only. And that is this scroll wheel on the side that allows me to do horizontal scrolling, which will be perfect for when I'm editing. Now, the next thing I got, that decal girl or whatever, uh, vinyl, in, and I'll, I'll put links to all this shit in the video just in case you want it. But the decal is pretty awesome. It's, it's fairly substantial. It's pretty thick. It's not like a cheap, really crappy one. You peel it off and it twists around and all that shit. Not so thick that it's gonna mess your computer up or anything, but it's cut perfectly. I couldn't have asked for an easier install. It, it just totally went on. And there were more pieces than I thought there were gonna be. So here, I'm gonna show it to you real quick. This is the back of the MacBook. They also gave me the bottom which I didn't realize I was getting. And it's perfectly cut out with the feet and the vents and everything. So it went on there with no problems. It also came, and this is what I was waiting for mostly, was right here where your wrists go on of the trackpad. But then they also put a piece up at the top there. So now this is perfect for when my hands are on here because my watch kept hitting on there and, and I heard it scratching and it was bugging me. So I didn't want to do that. I didn't like that at all. There you go, that's that. And again, I'm just waiting for the, the, the big mouse patty thing to go on here on this desk so I don't have to hear that sound of this mouse dragging across that wood. It's awful. I think if I didn't mention it or I cut it out, but I actually put that on, which was my photo deox light panel that i had used as my main light for a while and it gives me the ability to have a lot of light here so that i can actually see what the hell i'm doing so if i turn out you know my main light and all my background lights and all my overhead lights and all that shit, i will then have light to work at my desk because 
I'm gonna be working at this desk a lot. One, I like it. It's incredibly comfortable. It's big, it gives me a lot of room. And because I have good lighting in here now, again, I can do things like my receipts for my expense reports and things like that. Plus it's just nice to have something different instead of sitting over there at the, at the desk all the time. I can get up and walk my ass over here and work from here. Just something different just to keep me moving around. As soon as I get the mouse pad, that'll be the end of the video and I'll wrap it up and we'll go from there. So let's just sit here with our thumbs up our butts and wait. All right, kids, here it is, the final setup. So you can see this pad doesn't cover the entire area, which is fine because I don't need it to. It just needs to have enough room to sit the MacBook Pro on, the keyboard, and enough room to mouse. Now this mouse is supposed to have enough uh, like what do they call it like the the resolution or whatever the one that i was gonna get was four thousand but then this updated version has eight thousand like dots per inch which means it's more sensitive so that means that like i can i can mouse from one side of this to the other and and barely move this mouse a couple of inches and of course you can't really see that but that's okay take my word for it it's awesome okay so i have finished the day job project for what it's worth that's done i also got all of my packages in everything is unpacked set up the way that i want it to be set up and i have since ordered dinner online and i'm about to go get it and just in time because it just started a storm and now i can hear the thunder and see the lightning so perfect timing okay and that's it that's all i got for you today um not as shit as i thought it was because i've kind of been doing stuff and that's cool. I don't know what's up this weekend because I don't know what the weather's actually going to be like. And I'm not, I'm not going to plan anything. I know I want to go into Pleasure House Point because I haven't been there in so long. But again, it feels like 109 out today. Hopefully, I think the weather's only supposed to be in the 80s tomorrow, which will eliminate this awfulness that, that has been going around. But it is so humid that it's hard to breathe outside today and yesterday. So hopefully this rain will knock some of that shit out. But for now, I'm going to go get my dinner because I'm freaking hungry. I've been sitting here doing that stupid project and that. So that's all I've got for you today. If you have any comments, questions, or suggestions, leave them down below. As always, thanks for joining me. Be sure to like and subscribe. And remember, kids, forward and up.